Have I ever told you how I got my scar? No. No, you haven't. I wasn't much older than Kion when it happened. Back when I was leader of my Lion Guard. When I was the Lion Guard's fiercest, I took most patrols on my own. So when I met this strange lion, I had no fear of being alone. He said he had wisdom and power, and the most powerful should be king. With help from me and my roar, he and I could rule everything. I found his idea intriguing, though the most powerful lion was me. But the strange lion was scheming and had a friend I didn't see. That's how I got my scar when I let the god. The lion would cure the snake's venom as long as I did what he said. But I lost control and enraged. I roared and destroyed them instead. I expected to be praised near and far for stopping that treacherous thing. But Mufasa just nicknamed me Scar. Then I knew that he shouldn't be king. That's when I became Scar. When I led the God. My first plot for vengeance was spoiled when I lost the roar. My second plan later succeeded. Mufasa was king no more. Miserable Simba, I have ruled Fried Rock to this day. But now it is time for Simba and Kion to pay. That's why I still am scarred from when I led the god. Oh, that's why I still am scarred. And why. That's how it happened. Oh, yes. And so you see, Ushari, when the time comes, I will need your help. What's the plan? We need to be sure Kion can no longer control the roar. Which means today is the day Kion gets his scar.